quality of finish for the 3D MC squared is, is unbelievable. It's, it's, you know, it is great a finish. So where, where we would have used graders in the past to have finished off a job, we're finding now we can, we can finish it off with a dozer and, and get the same results. The last subdivision job I was on, uh, we sort of cut the, the time out needed for a grader by boxing out all the roads, uh, topsoiling, pretty much nearly start to finish, uh, the job was done with a dozer. Uh, I guess in the past we would have done that job with, with dump trucks, excavators and, you know, uh, rovers, uh, string lining for the boxing of the roads and that. And I was able to just go in and, and box the roads out to subgrade and push into piles for the excavator just to load out. So we, we'd reduced a lot of time uh, by not having an excavator there to, to box the roads out. From, from start to finish, uh, we had the subdivision done in, in about a month without drainage, but all our roads and topsoiling were done. Uh, I guess we'd, we'd saved five to six weeks from how we would have used to have done it. So using the, the 3D MC squared, we can run uh, dump trucks just to pile down topsoil and dump right across paddocks, whereas uh, with this system we, we can bulk that out and, and get a, a finished level fairly quickly whereas using a grader to move the same amount of material would probably take three, four times longer. It's been good having the dozer at this time of year, being the wettest it's been for 10 years, that there's been a lot of areas where we can't get graders in or it's, it's just been too wet to run uh, rubber-tied machines and, and the dozer's just taken over now with the 3D MC squared because we're, we're getting that uh, finished quality. Uh, Last month, uh, what I'd estimated to, to sort of turn over in hours uh, with the weather and stuff, uh, I averaged about 50 hours a week. And if I hadn't have had the, the Topcon system on, I wouldn't have got anywhere close to those hours. So having this system on's probably given me another 10 to 15 hours a week work.